What's it to you? They're no good in the secondary market anyway. Whatever you say, it's your money. Greta, come out now, for fun. Talk Ashley. Who's that? Let me introduce my gorgeous assistant, Miss Van Eyck. This is not a lot of money. So that I could safely move. What did you give me? Smile medicine. Tell you what. Since you and I go way back, why don't I just give you my old pal discount? What do you say? You don't remember me, do you? We know each other. Oh yes, we do. From where? DC? Uh, Baltimore. DC. Yeah. How we go way back? Uh, Solomon Pierre, MD. I was a plastic surgeon. You remember? Specialized in burn victims, mostly women. I put you away. Oh, yeah, you did. <laughs> you made those tapes. They were performance pieces. <laughs> you set your patients on fire. I'll put them out. Some not as quickly as others, but let's change the subject, shall we? The future is so much more interesting than the past, don't you think? Oh, Miss Van Eyck, I'm afraid she's already smitten. She only has eyes for you. I know what you're thinking, John. How can I do what I do now? Well, let's say that I did spend an awful lot of time in the prison library. Now, that was a great way to avoid some of the more unpleasant aspects of prison life. Confinement was a real education, a real... I open her. So, little asking you, Dr. Clark, you do the greatest job. I mean, for true enlightenment, there's nothing quite like, well, let's say, taking a shower while his large fellow with an attitude you can't even knock down with a hammer whispers in your ear, oh, Nancy, oh, Nancy. Now, that was a lot of fun. Thank you so very much, John, for putting that. Thank you so very much for giving me the opportunity to get to know myself so much better. And now, to return the favor. <laughs> 